What's up, legends? Welcome back to the channel. If you've ever played NFS Most Wanted 2005 and thought, man, I wish I could drive something wild like the SRT Tomahawk, well, today's your lucky day. I'm gonna walk you through step by step exactly how to add brand new cars into your game using a tool called Ed, the car dealer. No confusing stuff, no game crashes, just a clean, smooth install, even if you're doing this for the very first time. And yes, we're adding this monster, the 2013 SRT Tomahawk. It's a Vision GT beast that flies at over 400 km per hour. Trust me, if you follow this guide, you'll be cruising in your dream cars in just a few minutes. Let's get started, but stick around, because near the end, I'll also show you how to drive this beast in career mode, not just in my cars. Most people miss this part, but I've got you covered. Before we jump into the mod, big shout out to today's sponsor, SwiftDo PDF. If you're into downloading mods, walkthroughs, or handling college or work files, this tool is a lifesaver. You can edit PDF like Word, convert to and from Word, Excel, PowerPoint, turn images into PDF, and even translate full paragraphs to any language. Super useful for global users. Need to merge, split, compress, or protect your files? Done. You can even add e-signatures and annotations super easily. I use it myself for organizing modding guides, and it's fast, lightweight, and efficient. Try SwiftDo PDF for free using the link in the description, and grab the premium version at a discount. Thanks to SwiftDo PDF for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the modding guide. First, you need to download all these mods. Download Ed, the car dealer. NFS Most Wanted Unlimiter. NFS VLTED. Download the SRT Tomahawk mod from NFS Addons. You can also download other cars you want to add. Once downloaded, extract each mod one by one using WinRare or 7-Zip. Once you've extracted all the mods, go to the Car Mod folder, enter the Add-on folder, and copy these two files. Then go to the Add Mod folder and paste them here. Now again, go back to the Car Mod folder, enter the Add-on, and then enter Cars folder. Copy the folder inside, then go to your NFS Most Wanted Installed folder, enter the Cars folder, and paste it here. Now it's done. Next, go to the NFS Most Wanted Unlimiter folder. Enter the binary folder. Copy the scripts folder and then put 8.dll file and paste them into your NFS Most Wanted game directory, where the game is installed. Then, open the ed folder and run ed.exe. Click on main. Then open, select your game folder, where NFS Most Wanted is installed, then click OK. Now go to Tools. Then select Unlock Game Files for Modding. Click OK. You'll see the car name appear. Click Apply to install it. Click OK, then No, and close Ed. Next, go to the NFS VLT Ed folder and run NFS VLT Ed.exe. Click on File, then open and choose your game folder, where NFS Most Wanted is installed. Then go to File, then Import, then Mod Script. Choose your Car Mod folder, then enter the Add on folder. Select the .nfsms file and click Open. Now, click Install. Finally, click File, then Save, and then close NFS VLT Ed. Now launch the game, but create a new save file to make the mod work properly. Go to My Cars, and here it is. The 2013 SRT Tomahawk in your garage. You can customize this car however you want. Now, play the game. Over 400 km per hour, insane acceleration, and totally unique in the NFS Most Wanted 2005 world. You now have a car most players never even dream of unlocking. And if you want to drive this car in career mode, click on the screen and watch my video where I explain how to unlock any car in career mode. Got stuck? Let me know in the comments. I reply to everyone. Hit the like button if this helps. Share it with a friend who loves NFS games and subscribe for more modding tutorials, high-speed content, and epic car showcases. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.